in this question we have to tell out of four interaction one is strong force electromagnetic force and weak force uh, the electron take part or the neutron take part or the proton take part so the electron and neutron takes part in weak force or weak interaction the proton has the interaction with respect to strong force now in the second part of the question it has been asked quartz has been half and there are two types of quartz up quartz having spin plus half and a down spin having uh, down quartz having spin minus half so uh, we have to tell the fact that baryons has been half or 3 by 2 while the mesons has been 0 and up so we know that baryons are made up of three quarks if you consider the first case if both have plus half plus half plus half spin then the net spin of the baryon will be 3 by 2 and if the baryon having spin like that it consists of two down, uh, down quarks having spin half minus half and one up quarks then its net spin will be 1 by 2 hence it proves the first statement and for case of mesons we know that meson uh, consists of two quarks and if you consider both are up quarks that that is having spin plus half then the net spin uh, will be equal to 1 and if mesons have both the uh, one uh, as the down quarks that is having spin minus half and one is up quarks having spin plus half then the net spin of the meson will be zero and if we uh, define spin so spin is a vector quantity that represents the intrinsic angular momentum intrinsic angular momentum of a particle in the third part of course that suppose there are uh, there were a kind of neutron let that has uh, that was massless and had no color change and no color charge or electrical charge and did not feel the weak force so could you say that this particle even exists the answer is yes there could have uh, there could exist such a particle is it a particle with a 
no color change uh, no so no color charge so no color charge and no electrical charge thank you